Hey everybody, it's Eddie coming to you from Flagstaff, Arizona. It's a gorgeous day here in the fall. You guys see little duckies behind me floating around. Uh, this is a park near my uh, near my place and decided rather than shooting a video inside, I'd come out and enjoy the, it is still a little cold, it's t-shirt weather, but still a little bit cold. So anyways, hey, I wanted to shoot this video out and I read this quote today on Jeremy Howie's uh, Facebook page and he's somebody I met through. Uh, through all the people, the internet marketing, network marketing, and all that, and he's a huge name in the industry. And in Han, as he put, it is in your moments of decision that your destiny is written. And it was perfect timing because I'd been on the phone, making calls, talking, talking things over with this event that I'm putting on. And after I read that, it just hit hard. It hit home. And uh, what I have going on here is I'm putting together an event for Yes I Can, uh, which is based out of Williams, a nonprofit organization. And the event is called Get Empowered, which will be held on November 23rd. Is uh, That's when the date is. And I've been going full bore, going huff, I mean, just full, full bore. Talking, waking up at 1 o'clock in the morning after three or four hours of sleep, waking up at 1, not going to sleep till 2.30 the next morning. Uh, again, about three or four hours of sleep and going at it again. And it's not to impress you. It's not to ask for pity because I don't want it. It just means that is how important this event is to me. That's important. That's how much I want to impact the youth here. I'm willing to put in the work to impact the youth because I think that's where it starts. And a lot of it starts for me on my research, my uh, work I'm putting into my book, which is called Left Behind, Suicide's Rippling Effect. Um, and after having dealt with 12 suicides and seeing the impact it has on families' lives, um, something needs to get put out there. And I had worked on the book and looked at getting it done earlier, and then all of a sudden just something this told me to just kind of wait and, and get to do something still proactive. So I'm still working on the book, getting closer, but this event just hit me hard, and something told me, get this event, make it happen, and I did it on short notice, and kind of risky, might be dumb, might be stupid, but something said, go for it, get it done, I found speakers, I found Vidal, I didn't find him, Vidal and I have connected, but I got Vidal out of Wisconsin, I got Jay Boom out of Phoenix, I got Wally um, out of Phoenix, and they both have stories where they came from, North Dakota and South Central LA, um, got Brent Sutton, artist who came from Williams, small town, and he's been quoted, or not quoted, labeled as a possible heir apparent to Steve Vai, which is huge. You're talking huge, huge, huge. You're talking one of the elite guitarists in the world, and, uh, you know, came from small town Arizona, you know, in 2500, and is following his dreams, and that's what Get Empowered is about. It's about having this event, having four young ladies even be part of it to to be an to be co MCs, to to be a host or to to sing the national anthem. It's giving them opportunities, it's gonna spread amongst their peers that hey, if they did that, that was awesome. That looked fun, you know. Gives them something to look look forward to. And with the stories that'll be shared by the speakers, um, it, empowering stories, powering stories of resurrection, of um, you know, decision you make now can affect you 30 years from now. You know, overcoming adversity, like tough, tough adversity, or on how to deal with situations to, to not become, to not allow yourself to become a depressed person. How to perceive things that take place in this world, like losing a loved one, period, or losing somebody to suicide, or losing your job or going into bankruptcy, all this crazy stuff that's going on in the world today, we want to shed some light on it. Because I think, well, as they say, the youth are our future. And, and that's so true. So we want them to be heavily quit, equipped with strong mindsets, with options, with dreams, with, with the mindset to take action. And so my story here is, or my story, my request is a little bit of help. In this video, along with, there's going to be videos pumped left and right, so, so you guys beware, and not just by me. And we're going to spread this to as many people as we can. And we're seeking help, financial support. Uh, and if you can't, can't support financially, just share links. Share links, share links. I don't care if it's 5 bucks, 10 bucks, 100 bucks, whatever you can afford would be awesome. And we would be willing to co- 
co-sponsor this event with somebody that's willing to sponsor a comedian who contacted me on Friday. This comedian got wind. He's been on Comedy Central, Jay Leno. He has his own show up in Vegas. And without throwing his name out there, which I don't want to yet, is Bill Cosby is a big fan of this guy because he's clean. He's hilarious. And he just, uh, the guy's amazing. He's funny. But he called me on Friday and said, Eddie, I got wind of what you're doing. Um, I want to be a part of it. I got something else going on, but I'd rather be a part of your event because I know what you're doing. I know what you stand for. I know what these speakers stand for. So I would rather come there. And I'm willing to cut my price. I mean, let's just put it this way. If we went through his agent, probably be three or four times more than what he's willing to, to charge us. So if you're a co-sponsor, you got <clears throat> you know somewhat deep pockets and want to co-sponsor this, that would be awesome. That would be beautiful. And we might not have a comedian if we can't raise the funds. But if we could, that would be awesome. Because if anything, we still want the, the we're still going to have the four speakers and Brent. And we're going to have these awesome young ladies uh, be a part of this event as well. So, um, you guys got any questions, concerns, email me at vision at eddieaguilar.com. You can go to my blog site, which is eddieaguilar.com. Subscribe, enter your info, and I'll be happy to send you two pieces that I've written for my book uh, to you, which have already touched lives and the book's not out yet, which has been a blessing for myself and others as well. And uh, this, this video will be on GoFundMe.com project that I will be putting together this afternoon. And uh, please spread it. Even if you can't afford five bucks, please share the link. I mean, that's all we ask, and we're looking for, for anybody and everybody, and who knows in the future, you may have something that's dear and personal to your heart and be able to call and say, Eddie, I got something going on, you know, what would it take to get you here, and just something as simple as feed me and pay for my flights, you know, something about that, and that's what's the beauty of these speakers that are coming is the speakers that I have now pretty much coming for free, and I don't think people understand that these guys have a right to charge quite a bit. But because they support me, they support the Yes I Can Foundation, um, they want to touch lives. And these guys are true examples of servers, people that, uh, that are unselfish. And they're not looking at me, me, me. They're looking about impacting one life, just one life. If they can walk away from this event impacting one life, it would def that's more than anything that uh, money can buy for them so, and myself. So anyways... Uh, Please feel free to contact me, share the links, anything tied to this video. And I'm looking forward to the support, and we're going to do it. We're going to make it happen. So you guys have a good morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you are when you're watching this. Talk to you soon. Bye.